Alright, so... <clears throat> it's you and the robot. Once you get back to... Elden Volcano, and... Unfortunately, this is an escort mission, which... Typically are the worst missions in all of video games. So you have to protect this guy as you make your way back to the top of the volcano. And there's going to be quite a few archers along the way, but you've got bow and arrow too. And some of these big dudes. The annoying thing is that he like runs up close to enemies. So sometimes you have to jump in front of him and I don't know. You'll see. He can take like a couple hits, but he's pretty weak. So try not to let him get hit at all. Uh, I'm going to take this pathway to the left here. You cannot use the air vent. That hot air vent that like skips half the trek up the mountain. You can't use that. He can't follow you. Which is pretty disappointing. I was hoping that I could go that way. So just bomb your way through this if you haven't already. Come on. Oh my god. Hey, I caught his arrow. out these dudes. Takes quite a few arrows to kill these fat dudes. But if you sink a few into them, it will make it easier to finish him off. Oh, I guess he was one of the weaker kind. So I think, yeah, five arrows killed him. <clears throat> the dudes with um, the metal shields, those guys are significantly tougher. So it'll take more than five arrows. So depending on how many arrows you have left, you may not want to. 60 bucks in one shot. Alright. If you're low on arrows, you may just want to kill the guy with the sword. That guy's just a little too far away. So sprint up here. There was, there are some guys that you couldn't really see from below. So be careful because they'll start attacking that robot dude. So finish off the next couple guys with your bow and arrow. And make your way to the top. Look. 
back. So this is back to the temple, but not to the temple we're going to, unfortunately. We've got a ways to go. Take out these Bob Coblins. <laughs> and then this is one of the tough Metal Shield dudes. Hit him in the head, he looks like he's going to die, but then he doesn't. Anyway, I want to leave a few arrows left. So remember, jump over that guy's shield, and then go to town. And you see that robot, he's just like following super close. We could easily just wait 10 feet back while I kill him. So I didn't waste all my arrows on that last guy, mainly because I knew these three archers would be here. And so, I'm gonna decide not to use my arrows on this guy. Try to lure him off the bridge a little bit, because I don't really want to fall off. Alright, robot guy, stand back. There's a huge monster right there. Alright, I guess he's not going to come forward anymore. Oop. And I almost fell off anyway. Shut up! Gosh. Ah! That was cutting it close. Okay. <clears throat> so, once you get up here, back to the fire sanctuary, there is a checkpoint. Uh, if you die up to this point, it'll send you back to the beginning. But if you buy, die after this point, uh, it's a checkpoint. So I did die, actually, and it started me right back there. Um, like I said earlier, I hate the Lizifos, especially when there's two of them. And uh, I was focusing on one, and they killed the robot guy. And so when he dies, it's the same as you dying. So try to keep both of them in your sight. Make sure they're not killing the robot. Oh. Oh, oh I missed that lizard tail. Like half a second. You gotta kill these guys now because you don't want your buddy getting hurt. So just take him to the giant frog and he'll pour the water on its mouth and open up the fire sanctuary temple. This house is one, one, one. 